It opens at 10 a.m. and it closes around 6 p.m. And I'm actually with one of the artists right now. I'm here with Dan Lee. So there's a lot of artwork that you're providing this weekend and next weekend. But what are these right in front of us? These are sculptures that I started to try to develop from uh, scrap builder's beams. And I, <clears throat> I worked in sporty goods and the, my boss had a construction business and he brought this big beam back that he didn't use and I looked at that for a while and I said, I want to sculpture that. And what I found was, is because of the lamination designs is that it almost looks like some sort of uh, exotic woods and stuff. And as you round the laminations, it makes patterns like feathers and scales and stuff like that. And that's kind of how it developed yeah. as a sculpture media. Well, these are absolutely beautiful and there's a lot to see here. Thank you so much. Thank I'm actually going to take this walking stick and walk <laughs> over to Karen over here, our other artist. So Karen, can you go ahead and tell me about the paintings that you can see all around here? Um, I like to paint old vehicles. Mm -hmm. uh, the original paintings will not be under glass. They're oil. Um, the prints have glass and they're done by Charles St. Charles out of Cadillac. Yeah, and there's a lot of pictures of cars here, of paintings that you've done. Why do you like painting cars? I, I love them. I like to, to see them and then put them in a setting where I think they should be. Yeah, um, and I'm also I can't tell you what they are, but... <laughs> <laughs> but it looks good, and that's all that matters. And you also make these walking sticks as well? Yes, yes, yeah. walking sticks. So why should people come this weekend and next weekend to the show? Well, as I said before, we're not a business. Um, we love to do it and we love to share what we do. And this is the only chance that people get. It happens once a year. Once a year, the first two weekends in October. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. A lot of beautiful things here and you and Dan are both so very talented. And if you are interested in finding the barn, we're going to post the address on our website at 9and10news.com, but it's going to be a great show.